Shimon, nice to, nice to meet you. This is Tom Barnhart from Business Polska. I'm here today with uh, Shimon Stadnik from Frista, uh, retail solutions, and uh, wanted to take a few minutes, just about four or five minutes, to get an idea of what you guys are doing new. You're a new BPO on, on the scene in Warsaw, uh, but uh, nice to meet you today. And please tell, nice us, to tell us a little bit about, first of all, what you guys are doing, what, what is Frista, who is Frista, and uh, what are you guys doing here in your center in Warsaw? Mm -hmm. So Frista is a um, Swiss group. Uh, with a headquarter in Engelberg in mm -hmm. Switzerland and um, there's a mother company in Switzerland and um, we have operating center here in Warsaw okay. um, from which we serve international clients okay. um, for the moment we live <coughs> like a startup we just um, we're just starting we're preparing the marketing materials and um, and uh, um, the marketing campaign okay. um, our offer is um, addressed to international, medium-sized um, um, uh, groups, okay. um, not only from um, retail business, but of course um, um, this is our expertise, but um, uh, also from other um, okay. other sectors. How, how long have you been? By the way, how long have you been operating now in Warsaw? So in Warsaw, actually, as as Freestar, we okay. um, we're operating for for the last few months only because okay. we're really a startup. But um, Freestyle we started with 100 employees already. Well, right? yes. So actually, <laughs> Freestyle purchased a um, uh, shared service center which belonged to Talvai, yes. and um, 100 people which we currently employ are serving our uh, major clients, and this is um, Talvai for the moment. But we're hoping of uh, obtaining new clients in 2017. Okay, and the services you're providing right now for inside this operation, tell us about what. Your team is doing right now. Mm -hmm. So we have highly skilled specialists and mm -hmm. managers who are right now serving um, Talivel, but they are also prepared to serve other clients in two major areas. Uh, one is IT and administration, and the second area is uh, my finance and accounting. Okay. Um, in the uh, IT and uh, administration, we have uh, help desk, IT help desk, first and second line support. We have uh, customer service and omnichannel support, which serves um, both uh, clients from um, the stores, okay. um, but also uh, the e-commerce channel. Mm. Um, we have a uh, maintenance help desk, and um, the team which right now progressing or developing um, really fast, uh, SAP, um, in all the functionalities. So we have um, FICO specialists, we have uh, SD specialists, we have uh, developers. We do both um, operations mm -hmm. and um, we're running the projects as well. Okay. Um, so this is one area of, uh, mm -hmm. of expertise. The second is um, finance and accounting. And over here we, 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 we um, <coughs> provide services in all kinds of, uh, of uh, um, area so th this is um, accounts payable, accounts receivable. Um, this is general ledger, uh, accounting. We also have uh, retail specific services like uh, loss prevention, um, uh, shop control, and inventory accounts, uh, as well as payroll, which is um, uh, provided to or can be provided to all okay. all customers. And the the type of people. How, first of all, how many people have you got now working here uh, in the group at this stage? And I'm curious about. What languages they're speaking, what nationalities they're from, how many are Polish, not Polish? Mm -hmm. Give us a bit of an idea of who the staff is. So, uh, currently we, we employ around 100 people, okay. um, all specialists, okay. um, all with uh, higher education. Okay. Um, in our center, we speak right now seven languages, so we serve clients in seven languages. Um, this is Polish, well, of course, um, but English, German, French, uh, Italian, Czech, and Slovak. Mm -hmm. um, we employ both the managers and experienced uh, uh, specialists from from, uh, from audit companies, uh, charter accountants, or or um, uh, the experienced accountants, uh, as well as um, uh, some IT um, specialists, really experienced. Yeah. We in the SAP we have uh, people with twenty years experience, <laughs> really top professionals. Uh, on the other hand, we we also um, are attracting students or uh, graduates we, okay. who. Who um, who cho who are choosing um, uh, Freestyle as their first uh, place of work? Okay, okay. And in terms of the BPO business in Poland, or let's say in the region, um, you guys are coming into this from a different perspective, having bought a shared service center. 
but what is your view of the potential for this type of business in, in Poland in the next two, three, four years? And where are the clients coming from for the most part? So we are focusing on the clients from Western Europe, from okay. um, German speaking countries mainly. Okay. Um, so the, this is Switzerland, uh, um, German and Austria, okay. but also uh, France mm -hmm. and, uh, and UK also mm -hmm. utilizing the possibilities of uh, Brexit. Yes, yes. We're open on American companies yes, okay. whenever this is possible, but yeah. I think this will be the, the next step. Yeah. Um, I, I, we, we see a, a huge potential in Polish market. Um, we think that, that the, the, the market is uh, maturing right now. Um, the big international groups uh, are already well established in Poland, but, uh, but th there is quite a lot of uh, possibilities for medium-sized international groups, mm -hmm. uh, which might be attracted with, uh, with uh, uh, attractive costs, but also highly skilled um, uh, people. Um, what is happening right now in Poland is that, uh, on one hand, because of already established um, uh, shared service centers and BPOs, um, the, the, the qualifications of the, the people over here are, are growing That's significantly. Very important, yes. Um, the ecosystem is getting strong, for sure. Uh, yes, so, so this, is, uh, this is a great opportunity for the future. Um, on the other hand, still, there are quite a lot of clients which did not start uh, utilizing the full potential of um, not only cost cutting but improving the quality through the nursery yeah. exactly and uh, and those medium sized international groups um, will have quite a big pool of of, of great people uh, especially seen in Poland okay. Um, okay. to use okay. so Good. Congratulations. Good luck with the startup and good luck Thank with the Thank you very much. We'll check back in in a year or so with you, okay? Great. Thank, Thank you. you. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks.